Adelaide researchers are looking to gain a better understanding of the water resources beneath the city. The two-year project is the first comprehensive look at Adelaide's groundwater in more than a decade. South Australians are well aware how precious water is. Researchers at Flinders University and the CSIRO are turning their attention to the important resource that runs beneath us. It's very important to better get an idea of how much water flows from the hills uh, subsurface into the uh, deep aquifers underneath everywhere basically in the uh, Adelaide area. The $3 million study funded by the Goida Institute for Water Research will analyse the quantity and quality of Adelaide's groundwater. It takes in an area stretching from Malala to Seacliff and from the foothills to beyond the shoreline. The whole nation earns uh, $34 billion uh, in terms of groundwater related uh, business. Industry uh, rely very heavily on groundwater as well as market gardeners and also recreational uh, facilities. The Grange Golf Club is one such facility. It has eight bores across the property and relies on them as its primary water source. Without the bore water here we, we'd have uh, a hell of a lot of trouble. We wouldn't be able to maintain the courses without it. The club is mindful of the need to replenish the underground system. We look to harvest as much stormwater as we can through the year and actually inject it back into the aquifer, um, which is sort of stored there, and then we, we bring it out in summer for later for reuse. The study will also examine how the ocean interacts with groundwater and whether our resources continue beneath the sea. If we pump too much groundwater, uh, seawater can basically intrude into the aquifers and make them unusable. The project will take two years to complete. Alina Ecott, ABC News, Adelaide. A new memorial walkway linking the